वेलकम टू माय चैनल आर एल डी एकेडमी दिस इज लेक्चर नंबर सिक्स ऑन ऑपरेशनल एम्पलीफायर इन दिस वीडियो आई विल गिव यू सेकेंड अप्रोच टू एनालाइज हाउल एंड करेंट फार्म इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव डिस्कस द फर्स्ट मेथड फॉर दिस हाउल एंड करेंट फार्म So, Howland current pump. This is the circuit that we discussed last class. Here, the main objective is to provide a constant current I L, which is independent of the load, and this is generated from a voltage source V one. So, this will actually give you a voltage source to current converter and this was proposed by mit's professor bradford howland in 1960 thus the name is howland current pump and here we'll try to prove that this current il is given by v1 by r1 if r4 upon r3 equals to r3 upon r1 if this that condition is satisfied then current il is independent of the load and it is simply given by v1 upon r1 now look at the circuit here the load resistance is vl now as our objective is to find a current source which is independent of this load first what we will do we will consider this v1 r1 this voltage source and series resistance we will try to convert it to current source one current source with parallel resistance so voltage source to current source conversion that we can use so here you will see this is the current source and this resistance you know that the resistance will remain same if this resistance is r1 so here also it will be r1 and this current source its magnitude will be this voltage upon resistance so v1 upon r1 and it is upward current indicate that is minus 2 plus so this current source magnitude is v1 upon r1 and a parallel resistance with respect to this current source is r1 is connected now you see so we'll start from this figure and here as this network you see this one this all with op amp and r3 r4 connected and this side is r2 connected so this will behave as a resistance it is connected from this node and this ground so we can consider one equivalent resistance which will be connected from this node point to grounded and its value is suppose r equivalent so we will try to find out one equivalent resistance for this network first and then you will see this that resistance should be connected between this node to ground okay so our circuit will become like this so here the, from this node to ground r equivalent will be connected so this current source r1 resistance parallel to r equivalent and load will be connected and this load potential is vel right now we'll try to find out this r equivalent so how to find this one so let us check now this is circuit so from this point to this point the r equivalent we have to calculate to calculate this one what we will do will connect one source bs at that point 
so from ground to this point one source is connected vs and suppose the current i is supplied by this source then equivalent resistance of this network will be simply so this one is r equivalent equal to vs upon i okay that is equivalent resistance now i'll consider this one so this potential is vs this is your ground this one is v not so this circuit is a non inverting circuit non inverting amplifier and we know that gain is 1 plus rf by r1 in this case 1 plus r4 upon r3 that is again so output voltage v not will be 1 plus r4 upon r3 times vs so v not is now available with respect to vs okay this is your expression for v not now we need to find out the current i now to find this current i now you see this current is 0 ampere because of a high input impedance of this ideal of m no current can enter into the of m1 and now the current through the resistance r2 is suppose i2 this current is i2 so total current i is equals to 0 ampere plus i2 means total is i2 and i2 we can write that is vs this potential is vs and this is v0 so vs minus v0 upon r2 right now we can replace this v0 by 1 plus r4 by r3 times vs then if we simplify it you will see vs minus vs minus that terms so this vs minus vs will cancel each others then if you simplify it you will get minus r4 upon r2 times r3 times vs yes therefore the r equivalent will be simply vs upon i that is your minus r2 times r3 upon r4 and you see here this resistance is given by negative meaning is that the source is actually not supplying the current in positive direction in opposite direction current is coming that is because of amplification of this of amp so v not value is larger than vs okay next so this is your i equivalent resistance now that we can use it so this is our circuit and we have simplified it to this one one current source that resistance r1 now this r equivalent and this is the load right so this r equivalent is given by minus r2 r3 upon r4 now we can combine these two r1 r equivalent they are both are connected in parallel combination so this parallel combination we can write as r1 r equivalent upon r1 plus r equivalent we can replace r equivalent here and you will see you will get this one now our objective is to get il which is independent of vl so if this will happen if this combination will draw zero current okay no current is drawn by this circuit so total whole current is should flow to the load in that case the it will be independent of the load that's imply that that resistance combination r1 equivalent r r1 parallel to r equivalent this one should give infinite impedance and it will become infinite if and only if this denominator term is equal to zero right therefore we can say that this il will be equal to is equals to v1 by r1 under condition 
that this r1 r4 minus r2 r3 that is equals to 0 and if you simplify it you can rewrite as r4 upon r3 equals to r2 upon r1 so this is the band's condition of this bridge and if it is satisfied then howland current source will generate will be generated and it will be independent of the load so this is the proof the second method so we are done so if you have enjoyed this video then you can subscribe my channel and to subscribe this channel you can press the subscription button and then after that you should press the bell button as well then only you will get immediate notification of my future videos so thanks for watching and i hope you are going to subscribe my channel thank you